There is a baseball bat. Dad, that's not one of our bats, is it? No. No. McFly's never use aluminum bats. Curious. Oh, wait, don't touch it. It's evidence. Of what? Oh, why would anyone do a thing like that to a nice Sector L citizen like me? <laughs> What's the last thing you remember? <sighs> I was sitting right here, copying another incriminating scene onto my... My tapes. My tapes? What happened to my tapes? Stay calm, Dad. Are they on the floor? Do you see them? They're in a box marked raw footage. They're all empty. Here it is. Raw footage. Thank heavens. Wait a minute. You see, I told you you were just jumping to conclusions. All these dark suspicions about thieves and attackers went all the time. It was just... Empty. What? There's no tapes. But I'm sure they were in there before. Before whoever it was whacked you in the head and took them. Oh my gosh, I've been mugged. Mugged in Hill Valley. They can't get away with it. Oh! Don't worry, Dad. We'll get to the bottom of this. Who... who could have done this to me? Edna Strickland. Who wouldn't want Doc to get the straight dope on Hill Valley? Edna! Are yep. you saying I was mugged by the mayor's elderly wife? Yes. Um, not exactly. No. Oh, it's no use. The tapes are gone. All I can do is hope against hope they don't surface and land me in trouble. Come on, Dad. We can't just give up. Uh, I don't like police. Let's start grilling people, or let's look for more clues. Let's look for more clues. I mean, maybe there's some more clues around here. What's the use? Even if we find out who took the tapes, we're not going to be able to get them back without attracting attention to ourselves. There's got to be something we could do to get our hands on those tapes. Well, we can make new ones. We can? Sure. It may take a while, but if you're willing to help your old man out, it shouldn't take us more than, say, six months? Six months? But I need those tapes now. You need the tapes. Uh, what I mean is... Um, I hate for you to lose all that work. I'm worried about your safety. Justice must prevail. I need to give it to Citizen Brown. I gotta give it to Citizen Brown. I told him I was going to furnish him with proof that Hill Valley isn't as happy as he thinks it is when I was in his office, just before I came here. Yep. You had an interview with Citizen Brown? Yes. It wasn't easy to get, believe me. I had to break all kinds of rules. You've been breaking rules? Yes. Harboring stray dogs, kissing girls in public, getting caught with Mom's flask. That is the most far-fetched story I've ever heard. It's true. You forget I'm your father. I know your history. Yeah, well... History's changed. Prove it. Prove it. Okay. Uh, here. Read him and weep. Demerits, but... It was the only way. I don't understand. Dad, listen to me. I mean, really listen. You and I both know that things aren't right here. Citizen Brown might have started with good intentions, but his Hill Valley's just made everybody miserable. Shh! You said that to him? Basically, yes. yeah. Oh... There go our privileges. No, wait, I got him to listen, Dad, and he's gonna make things right for you and Mom and all of us. I can't explain how. You're just gonna have to trust me on this. Okay. But first I have to show him your tapes to prove my point. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Dad. This scheme of yours. Maybe you know what you're doing. I can't say. But leave me out of Dad. it. Dad. I don't like trouble. I can't handle it. It's not in my genes. But... Do it for your family, do it for Citizen Brown. Do it for Arthur. <laughs> do it for your father. My father? Yeah, Arthur McFly. I know his name. Didn't he have something to do with putting away Kid Tan and, you know, way back when? Yes. Yes, he did. Where do you hear about that? It was way back before Citizen Brown cleaned up the town, before I was even born. Everyone lived in terror of Kid Tannen and his goons. But Dad stood up to him. He had evidence of Kid's guilt, see, and he risked his life to deliver it to the authorities. Never be afraid to do the right thing. 
That's what he always used to tell me. And what are you doing? Trying to remember which is the right feed. Feed to what? To the surveillance camera, the one in the yard. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You have a surveillance camera trained on yourself? Of course. Gotta cover all bases. Now help me figure out which monitor I'm on. Uh, how do I do that? Got it. It's this one, I think. Let me just make sure. Uh, oh, maybe not. Hmm. Uh, which monitor you are on? I don't know. It's a very good question. Okay, uh, probably the broken one. Hey, it's not working. That it? You're looking for the one that's trained on us. But there isn't one. Hmm. Oh, I can switch it. Okay, gotcha. street. Where's this one gonna take us? Garage, there we go. Hello? Hello? Uh, it's this one dead. Hello? How do I... Let me get this straight. You captured this whole attack on tape? Of course! Surveillance is what I do! Why didn't you say so in the first place? Come on, son. Stop dawdling and help me track down that feed. I just Try did. flipping the switches. I already did. It's right here. Hello? Oh, come on. I... I... It's right there. Hello? Oh, for the love of God. George, hello. Open your eyes. The monitor's dead. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. There! That looks like us! So the surveillance tape must be on... This VCR! This must be before the attack. Let's see... I remember cleaning the playback heads at 5.30. The attack couldn't have been very long after. I'm Biff! Biff. But it can't be him. The Citizens Plus program has rendered him as gentle as a... Kitten. Huh? huh? I can't understand it. That's not the way he's supposed to behave. Why, even the old Biff would hey, never... wait, what's that weird flashing on his wrist? Let's find out. I knew this zoom and enhance feature would come in handy someday. Cost me a bundle at the hobby shop. It's his digital watch. I wonder why it's doing that. Hey, wait, wait, stop the picture. Can you zoom in anymore? Oh, it's a controlling device. Look at that. X11. You know what that means? Not yet. Lorraine! Don't lay into me, George. I've got something very important to say, and then I'm going to be leaving again. I've got something important to say, too. I was attacked it's and robbed. It's always Rob... about you, isn't it? You can't just wait and listen to my news. Oh, no, you have to go and beat me to the punch. That's right. You two sort things out. I've got some business to attend to. I know it was Edna Strickland that sent Biff, but I, I should have realized it was Biff because there was a baseball bat. Duh, that's his signature. Biff! Whoa, settle down there, fella! You beat up my dad. Do we have a problem here, citizens? No, no, officer. Just a little misunderstanding. I'm sure we could work it out. Right, Martin? Sure. Okay. Let me know if you need any help, Mr. Tannen. <laughs> now let's see if we can get to the bottom of this. Yeah, let's. <laughs> Why did you beat up my dad? Why'd you hurt my dad, Biff? He never did anything to you in this timeline. Timeline? 
What are you talking about? Don't play dumb. I saw you on camera. But I can't hurt anybody. Thanks to Citizen Plus, I blow chunks whenever I even think about doing bad stuff. <laughs> See? That was gross. Uh, where were you and my dad was attacked? If you didn't beat up my dad, then where have you been for the last couple of hours? Well, I was... I was... What? That's strange. I, I don't remember. Go figure. So, mind control. Or behavior control with some sort of social therapy. What's the last thing you remember? Yeah, probably, he's probably gonna say something about Edna Strickland or something. What's the last thing you remember before your memory loss? Well, I was handing out flyers for the Citizen Plus program, just like I'd been doing all day. I just finished giving some leftover bologna to a cute little squirrel when Miss Edna came by. Edna? Uh-huh. Yeah, she wanted to run a, a, a diagnostic on my Citizen Plus watch. I must have fallen asleep or something, because when she was done, it was an hour later. And then your mom came by. Edna was fiddling with your watch. Uh, what was my mom doing here? What's my, where's my dad's secret tape? Uh, what was my mom doing here? I'm guessing maybe that tape got out or something. What was my mom doing here? Oh, she was just handing over her paperwork for the Citizen Plus program. Okay. What? Oh, yeah. I don't know how to tell you this, Martin, but your mom's in pretty rough shape. Yeah, but to sign up for Citizen Plus. She was on the fence for a while, too. But after you took the blame for her secret drinking problem, she realized she needed serious help. Oh, no. Mom. Yep. Now she's going to be mind-controlled. All right. Edna was fiddling with your watch, huh? I bet she set the settings to X11. So the last thing you remember before my dad got beat up is Edna fiddling with your watch? Yeah, that does sound pretty bad, doesn't it? All right, let me see your watch, Biff. Biff, your watch. Does X11 mean anything to you? X11? Is that a new band or something? I don't go in for that new hippity hoppity stuff. It's not a band, Biff. It's a mode on your Citizen Plus watch. Weird. I've never seen it look like that. Heck, I can barely get this thing to stop blinking. See? Hmm. What if I set it to X? Wait. I can't get it to set to X. Okay, hold on. Wait a minute. I have an idea. Hold on. As soon as I can get this to go back to zero. Okay, mode. Cool! A. Oh. Hey, I didn't know you could do that! There we go. Nope. Other way. X. Eleven. Biff? Okay, that's weird. Did you attack my dad? Did you attack my dad? <laughs> well, now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Could you, um, touch your nose? Could you, uh, oh, touch toes. your toes? Uh... Ah. Hmm. Okay. Do the chicken dance. <laughs> Do the chicken dance. Oh, this yeah, is he's wrong. hypnotized, all right. This is wrong. <laughs> okay. Um, where's my dad's tape? Maybe he'll take me to it. Where's my dad's tape? Uh, ah, in the, the decycling, decycling bin. Okay. Could you do me a favor and go get my dad's tape? Uh. Hey, Mr. Tin. What's up? Uh, 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 is that McFly kid bothering you? Uh, hey, you can't go in there. Uh, uh, hey, oh, whoa, uh, holy smokes, w w what happened to him? I don't know. No one's ever jumped into the decycling bin before. <laughs> well, where does it go? That information is above my pay grade. Oh, jeez. I'm in a lot of trouble now. Don't move a muscle, McFly. I gotta go tell Citizen Brown about this. Okay. 
You go talk to Sinister Brown. I'm gonna jump in the bin. I've got a really bad feeling about this. Well, here goes nothing. Here we go. Ouch! Gosh, ma'am! Did I do something wrong? Did I do something? Mr. Tannen, I put a lot of work into honing you as the first Citizen Plus. What on earth possessed you to assault a police officer and dive head first into the decycling bin? Did I do all that? Lord, I thought your father was dim. No, really. I don't remember doing anything like that. The last thing I remember, I was showing that nice McFly kid my watch. Then, blam, I'm down here and you're yelling at me. McFly? Yeah. Ah! Oof. Hello. I'm McFly. back. McFly. Strickland. Oh, hi, Martin. Battle of the Wits. Give me the tapes, Edna. Mr. Tannen, please restrain our guest. Uh... Biff, stop! Stop! Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you see arrow keys or click around and drag, to, drag around to look. Uh, okay, there's a dog. Einstein? Doggy? Huh? Tannin! Focus! Uh. <laughs> Doggy? <laughs> uh. Come on, Biff! Snap out of it! Ah! Okay, um. Come on, Biff. Snap no, out of it. Work. All, right, ah. all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, dear, Mr. Wilson. You have been a naughty boy. Wait, what? Why won't it let me? Oh, there we go. Uh, what are we looking at? I don't... What? I'm so confused. Okay, hold on, hold on. Nice and easy. Oh, okay, I don't want to look at that. <laughs> uh, Pinball parts. Pinball parts? Oh, am I really gonna have to? So, Biff, uh... Biff, look! Girly mags! Boobies! Oh my god. What's going on? Biff, Howard, Tannen! Obey your programming! Ah, ah. You see, Mr. McFly, thanks to the enhancements I've made to the Citizen Plus program, I can bring even the most rabid of dogs to heal. I think Martin will make a nice Citizen Plus pinball parts. Uh, come on, Biff, snap out of it! Ah! What do I need to do? I don't know what to do to get him to oh, monitors. Biff, it's your favorite show. Damn, what would really get Biff's attention down here? Uh, <laughs> I can answer that, but you might not like that. Uh, oh, nope, down, down, down. There we, there we go. Hit him right in the come nuts. on, Biff! Snap out of it! <laughs> oh, come on! Look at all these unhappy faces on oh, your father's beer. videotape. Hey, look over there! It's beer. Beer? Where am I? Tannen, I didn't go behind my namby pamby husband's back so you could wallow in your vices. Uh, oh. Oh, come on. The beer should have worked. Come on, Biff. Snap out of it. Ah! All right. What else is down here? Oh, no, 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 no. So much vice and disorder. And to think Emmett actually oh, wanted wait, to wait, shut down the wait. X-11 oh, initiative. So, holy crap. This is so, okay. Novelties? Novelties? Biff, whoopee cushions. You never had much of a sense of humor. Alright, I don't know what I'm supposed to... I don't see anything up there. I don't see anything there. The beer didn't work. Uh... Cigar? It's no use struggling, Mr. McFly. Uh, Biff, aren't those your favorite cigars? Cubans? Tannen, listen to me! Uh? Babes. Oh my god. Uh? Booze! Uh? <laughs> what the fu- ah! 
mommy. Oh. Okay, he's out cold. <laughs> Tannin, get up, you useless slacker! Come on, Edna, give the poor jerk a break. A break? You sound like my wishy-washy husband, always trying to find the good in people, never wanting to accept the fact that some people are just born bad. Maybe, but that doesn't give you the right to turn them into zombies. Now, give me my dad's tapes so I can- You mean those tapes I erased while you were struggling with my zombie? What? Come on. Utopias are fragile things, Mr. McFly. Especially when overseen by minds as distractible as my husband's. No. No! Edna! Mm. Doc? Edna! You heard it all. What are you doing here? I came down here to investigate a troubling report involving Mr. Tanner. Doc, you gotta stop her. She. Silence! Okay. I was concerned there might be a flaw in my Citizen Plus program. Imagine my surprise when I found my wife perverting my life's work. Oh. Oh, you caught. Is this what it's all been about, Edna? All those years? All our struggles to cure society's illnesses? Just to create a world where free will can be turned off with a flick of a switch? Oh, please, Emmett. You wanted this just as much as I did. Remember, if only we could tell someone to stay off the grass and so help us, they would never tread foot on a well-manicured lawn again. That's what Citizen Plus does. Oh it makes rules unbreakable. I only gave it the slightest of changes. Enough. We will not have this discussion here. But Go home and wait for me. Oh boy. You screwed up. Fine. Oh, boy. Doc! Ah! Okay. Father, what have I done? Uh... Don't be so hard on yourself. I'm sorry about Edna. Your father wouldn't blame you. Um, don't be so hard on yourself. Doc, don't be so hard on yourself. This Hill Valley may be a little messed up. Okay, a lot messed up, but you were just trying to help people. Or was I just entranced by the challenge of transforming the human psyche like so many chemicals? I'm sorry about Edna. I'm sorry about Edna, Doc. She didn't seem so bad back in 1931. No, she wasn't. When we were first dating, she was so spirited, principled, compassionate. When did I lose her? <laughs> Your father wouldn't blame you, Doc. I'm sure he wouldn't blame you for all this, Doc. He was so happy when I gave up my childish dreams in favor of Edna's more practical pursuits. Are you proud of me now, Father? Uh oh. Ah! Enough wallowing! What's done is done. It's time to look forward. Mm -hmm. Maybe, but maybe not. What? Your notebook from the other timeline. Not this foolishness again. Look, you can use it to repair the time machine and fix all this so it never happened. Everyone could be back the way they're supposed to be. You, Edna, Jennifer, my parents. Doc, you once told me if you put your mind to it, you could accomplish anything. Well, accomplish this. There's a lot of empty pages. The only one you need is right here. Flux capacitor. Great Scott. Martin, this, this could work. <laughs> It'll take time, of course, but once it's done, we'll have all the time in the world. Ha ha! Ha ha. Doc? Martin, we must get started at once. Come on! Can we bring Einie along? 
The dog. Yes, of course. You know, I used to love dogs before Edna came along. Yes. You don't say. I'll go ahead and start preparing a lab. Edna will be furious, but who cares? We've got a time machine to fix. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, boy. All right, so let's get Ainy out of here. Uh, open a cage. Don't worry, boy. I'll get you out of here in no time. What is it, Ainy? McFly. Yeah. Oh, boy. Hey, Biff. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Better than I've been in a long time, you know? So you remember... That witch making me do stuff? Yeah, she'll get what's coming to her. No one tells Biff Tannen what to do. No one. Hey, I I'm the guy who snapped you out of it. Really? Because all I remember is a punk kid who thought it'd be funny to make me jump down a hole. Oh, ah. boy. Oh, boy. Okay. What do I need to do? I hope I don't run out of rock. Okay, that's not gonna work. Uh, I need to move. I need to move. Down, Biff. I stay. Okay, quick. Open the cage. All right. McFly! Oh, crap. All right, McFly. Time to race the music. Face. It's face the music, you idiot. <laughs> Can I tackle him? Einstein? Ah. Get him, Einy! Tiny, sick him! Whoa! Oh. oh. I, not sure what I have to do here. Uh. What? What do I? Oh, what was that? There's something over here. What? Where was it? No. Hello? Oh, there it is. Panic button. Place your bets. What the? Oh. Oh, this is the old speakeasy. That's cool. Let's get out of here, Einy. That's pretty cool. Da, 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 da. Doc! Sorry I took so long. Biff came around and jumped me. Edna's there. I totally laid him out with the old ruler. Martin McFly. Yep. Edna? It's almost impressive how many years of work and planning you nearly ruined in just a few short hours. Where's Doc? Oh, Doc. My husband is in a better place. Better place? What have you done to him? Relax, Martin. We've got everything under control. Oh, boy. Oh. No! No! Doc! His eyes are being forced open. Oh, he's going through the program, I'm guessing. Oh, what a cliffhanger. That's not fair. Alright, let's take a look at this little short preview of what the next game has for us. Here's the real story. I'm a Marty McFly from an alternate timeline. And uh, why? Because you're weak, Emmett. What can I say? She's my muse. I'm not sure I like where this is going. It's almost embarrassing how devoted he is to me. You gotta believe me, Jennifer. This whole town's gone crazy, and Citizen Brown and I are the only ones who can fix it. There is no future for us. Double visions. Coming soon, even though it's already out. <laughs>